Hi guys, Steve here from Coffee Collection. This week I'm doing a number of posts on super automatic coffee machines. In my uh, past life, I worked on uh, bean to cup machines, commercial bean to cup machines, and this is a brew unit from a bean to cup machine. Massive stainless steel, very high quality. What happens here is, is that it grinds the beans here, this is a grinder, it then pushes the uh, beans through this chute and it comes down into a section where it tamps the, the coffee grounds and then it expresses, the water comes in through here and expresses the water and you get a beautiful uh, creme laden shot of coffee. Whoever invented this must have been an absolute genius. It's very high quality, there's a couple of big powerful motors in it. And this basically takes the place of the barista. So uh, you see the Gaggia machine over here. This is uh, barista driven. This one here is an automatic. And nine times out of ten, whenever I got a, a service call to have a look at these machines, there was something wrong with this brew unit, brew and grinding unit, mainly due to lack of maintenance. Now. What's happened over the years is they've taken this concept of this automatic barista type uh, machine and they've created a smaller brew unit like this for the home or the domestic market. And as I've said before, you've got Jura, you've got uh, DeLonghi, Gaggia and Seiko. And these are the brew units. They basically do the same thing. There's a grinder sits on top, it then pushes the, uh, the grinds into this chute, it then automatically tamps it and the water comes in through here and it expresses through the, through the coffee and you get a lovely shot of uh, creme laden coffee. So as with commercial machines, this poses a problem with automatic coffee machines because very few people do anything to actually look after this. There's seals in there, there's shower screens in there, they get coffee grounds all over there that need to be scraped out. So this needs to be cleaned on a regular basis from the variety of machines. Some machines they are easier to do than others. Seiko and Gaggia uh, are quite easy to do. DeLonghi and Jura are a little bit more complicated. But uh, one of the best ways to do it, and I'll put a picture on uh, how to do this, but if your machine has a section on the top where you can put a little uh, tablet into the uh, uh, coffee oil tablet, which will reduce the, uh, the oil buildup in these uh, brew units, it usually goes in the, uh, the ground coffee chute at the top of the machine. And if that's done on a regular basis, it will clean out this, this brew unit. And of course, from time to time, you need to take it out, give it a good wash and grease it up with a little bit of lube. So that can be one of the problems with the, one of the issues with the super automatic coffee machines. But that problem can be eliminated with a little bit of thought, care and maintenance. So I hope that's helpful.